Ho-ho! <laughs> Let's start the lesson on studying tanks. Children, listen to me carefully. Oh! Kids, now you're going to study airplanes in a poor school. I'll tell you everything. And most importantly, don't get distracted. If I find out that you are not writing anything down, then I will stop teaching the lesson and kick you out of class. Hmm. Do you understand what I said? I look at my students now and realize that they are not listening to me very carefully. What do you want to tell me now? Please explain. Look, there's a rich tank school there. Huh? I can't believe my eyes. You're really right now. I want to run over there as soon as possible and see what they're doing. I think it will be interesting to have a confrontation between our classes. Wait for me here. I'll be there soon. <sighs> Come with me quickly. I want to go to that school. I think it will be very interesting. Hmm. Take a good look at the board now. I've written down everything you need to know here. Mikey, why did you come here? Can you please explain to me? You have no idea what I've come up with. Let's go to the window and I'll show you. I have a school of planes and tanks. Let's have a confrontation between our classes now. <laughs> I think it will be very interesting. I want to find out whose children are really better educated. So I won't distract you too much. Prepare now as best you can and the confrontation will begin soon. <laughs> Mikey has surprised me a lot right now. I did not expect that he wanted to hold a confrontation. So now I'm going to go to my class and ask them what they really want. I need to find a student who will control the technique and still win this battle. Huh? Very interesting. Now I'm running very fast to my class. I want to find out who is really ready to go and join this battle. Students, which one of you wanted to ride a tank right now? I'll give you an excellent grade. I'm ready. Now I will do what you say because I want a good grade. Uh-oh. You are my best student. Let's run now. At the beginning, have a very tasty meal and prepare for the confrontation. You will need to do a lot and it is a big responsibility. Therefore, now, rest and eat delicious food. You should be rested and not worry in any case. <laughs> I will explain everything to you, and I am sure that you will definitely win in the confrontation between our classes. So now I will give you all the necessary tools and weapons. Hmm, it will help you, and I will explain how to use it. Therefore, try not to use it ahead of time. Listen to me carefully now, if you make mistakes, then we will have very serious problems, and I definitely don't want that. <laughs> Now you get in the tank and we'll wait for Mikey to come to us. He's been delayed a lot because we agreed to meet with him in advance, but he doesn't want to come out. What does Mikey do? That's it. I'm definitely not going to wait for him. So now I'm running to his school. I want to see how he teaches lessons and what's inside. It became incredibly interesting to me. What is it on its walls? They are all painted and I am incredibly surprised. This is a terrible school. Mikey, what are you doing there for so long? It's time for us to go to battle. Let's not waste time and see what your school has as soon as possible. Hmm. We're going to the dining room now. I'll show you everything. You have no idea how cool it is here because I feed my students very unusual food. They all like it, so you can eat whatever you want. I will now give the students some food and we will immediately run to prepare everything necessary for our battle. You will soon see what a powerful tank I took in order for it to pass the obstacle course. Mikey, it seems to me that you are exaggerating too much. I don't see anything beautiful and good here. <laughs> so let's not just talk like that and quickly explain to the students what they will need to do. I didn't like your dining room. The school looks disgusting. How do students study in such conditions? Show me the tank soon and we'll go. Great. Then now our students will drive their tanks to the starting line. We definitely need to prepare an obstacle course. Let's work together to come up with all the traps that our students will have to go through. I think it's very interesting and we'll find out about it soon. My student will definitely not lose, so we need to build fast. Let's get started. Ho <laughs> ho! Mikey, let's share our responsibilities now. I'll build my part of the track and you come up with traps yourself. So now place the spikes and I'll make special obstacles. It will be very difficult for our students to overcome them. I think that this will definitely be able to understand what skills they have managed to gain in our schools. 
The obstacle course will take a very long time to build, but there will be a lot of traps. The good thing is that I offered you a confrontation. I think it will definitely show which of us is really the best teacher. I can say with confidence that my student is ready for anything, and now this time he will be completely ready. Huh? So hurry up with your fences. I've made a lava pool now, so you'll have to make paths there. I love working with you. You are really very well prepared. So let's not waste time now and do everything as planned. This obstacle course is going to be very dangerous, and I don't want the students to have any indulgences, because the skill level depends on it. This is definitely not the end of our route, because we have to check the equipment of our tanks. I want to see how your student shoots. This is a very good idea. Keep doing whatever you want. I'll get on with my business for now. I still have a lot of ideas about this obstacle course, and I'm definitely not going to stop. As soon as we finish it, we'll immediately see what came of it all. Uh-oh. I want to see how our students will ride tanks as soon as possible. We continue to work further. Super! Now I have made a very dense wall of stone in several layers. It will need to be pierced <laughs> with the help of tank shells. It will be a very difficult test for our students, but I think they will cope with it. So now, Mikey, we need to speed up. The students are waiting for us at the beginning of the route and want to start the confrontation as soon as possible. Therefore, we definitely cannot stay long. Ho <laughs> oh. I totally agree with you. Therefore, now I will help you put a huge number of spikes next to it and make additional traps in the form of pits with water. I think that our track already looks very cool and it will be incredibly difficult to pass. Let's try to make it heavier somehow now because it seems to me that this is not enough for the students to prove their abilities. That's a good idea, Mikey. I didn't expect you to give it to me now. I see from the outside that our obstacle course looks incredibly cool. It's definitely not worth stopping at this. Oh! I'm going to study all the worst sides of our track and try to eliminate them. I see that you are starting to set traps. This is very good, so we continue to work. I really like what we do. It really turns out to be a lot of fun and cool. I did not expect that we would build such a track in such a short time. Let's now make an additional platform on which the tanks will need to go. I am sure that you will succeed. Therefore, do this job now, and I will help to complicate this track. I'll set up a lot more traps. I'm in a good mood. Hmm. I am already starting to build a new platform, and it will be very difficult to pass it. You understand that this can be a great challenge for our students. I already doubt myself that it is possible to pass it. Our obstacle course consists of several stages and levels. Therefore, now you need to place as many spikes as possible. I want to see how it will look after we finish the construction. You never cease to amaze me. This is really a very dangerous track and it will be extremely difficult to pass it. I think we can handle all the problems you're talking about. Our students will soon come into confrontation and we will see who really prepared them better among us. At the moment, we are moving at a very fast pace. Just look at how short a period of time we've built all this. It's hard to disagree with you. I've already placed almost all the spikes and now I need to make a fire. So I'm taking out a lighter and putting it on the rise. You have no idea how much I want to see how they can cope with this challenge. I cooked them very well and nothing can stop him. Mikey, I don't understand where you've gone now. Huh? Don't worry, I'm here. I just had my own things to do. So now let's move on. I was completing a part of the track that you built and made balls that you will need to shoot at. Therefore, we will soon see how the students really cope with our trials. I never would have thought that we could almost complete such a huge obstacle course in such a short period of time. <laughs> we need to hurry up. There is very little left and our students will start a confrontation. I think this is going to be a legendary battle in which you lose to Mikey because you don't stand a chance. Let's go to the beginning of the obstacle course now. Let's see how my student will pass. He will be the first to overcome the obstacle course. Great, the race is starting now, and we'll see how my student gets through it all. Hmm, I can't believe it, but he's doing very well. He is now overcoming all the challenges that we have prepared very well. Soon, he will be destroying the wall with missiles. After that, he will immediately go to the platform where there are a huge number of spikes and other traps. I hope that everything will work out for him now, and he will not get hurt in any way. 
I would never have thought that my student could handle a tank so skillfully. He is really very good at overcoming this track. <laughs> it remains only to watch him and be happy, because soon he will arrive at the finish line. It seems to me that Mikey's student is already upset because he definitely won't be able to drive like that. We will definitely look at it soon. Now my student is going to the finish line. <laughs> Amazing! Your student drove very fast right now. I didn't expect him to have such cool tank driving skills. Now it's time to see how my student can handle it. Look from the outside how all this will happen. Then let him start the race as soon as possible. I am sure that he will never be able to overtake my student. Therefore, Mikey, now I will fly after him and together we will find out how he really copes with the tests that we have prepared. Now I see that he has already started moving. He has a lot of problems. He constantly runs into mines and loses a huge amount of time because of this. Mikey's student studied the obstacle course that we built very poorly. He falls for almost every trap that is here. I am extremely surprised at what he is doing because he is now starting to shoot at the wall. He can't do anything. The missiles are flying in different directions. I thought it was one of the easiest tests, but he showed himself very badly even here. Hmm. Therefore, I continue to keep an eye on what he will do. I think Mikey's student has already lost because now he is very far behind in time and passes the obstacle course badly. I can imagine Mikey's face how upset he will be when he sees his student's result. I think our victory will be unconditional here and there will be no point in doubting it. Soon he will finish the tests and return to the finish line. Very bad. <laughs> I still can't believe that Mikey was hoping to win. Now the student will arrive, Mikey will be very angry, and will definitely not be able to accept this defeat. Therefore, now we can only watch and rejoice as my student won. Everything turned out just fine for me. How did you manage to drive so badly this time? You realize that you have lost, and now there is no point in competing on tanks. Therefore, I have another suggestion. Let's check who among our students controls airplanes and helicopters better. There is an obstacle course that will need to be passed. So let's have my student fly first now. Woohoo! Mikey, anything! I'm sure you won't have a chance to win anyway. My school is much better because I have been teaching them for a long time and they know how to proceed. I will choose the fighter because my student was trained on it. Now it's time to finally see how a student of your school will take off in a helicopter. I am very interested to know what progress he will show you. Oh! I will watch him very carefully and see how he flies through the rings on the obstacle course that are in the air. As soon as he arrives at the finish line, my student will immediately begin to pass these rings as well. I see that now this helicopter manages very hard and it takes an incredibly long time. I made one conclusion, Mikey is a bad teacher. He'll be done flying soon. I want to see as soon as possible how my student will cope with this. Therefore, it remains only to watch how he flies through the remaining rings. Mikey and I will then discuss why his students are so poorly trained. Uh-oh. I think we need to give a couple of lessons to Mikey because he doesn't understand how to teach children at all. At the moment, everything is very bad, and I am sure that my student will fly much better. There's not even any doubt about it. Mikey will soon be very upset when he finds out how much time his student has flown by. At the moment, all this just makes me laugh and I'm happy. Oh. Indeed, the track is very difficult, but if you study well, you can definitely fly it much faster. The helicopter is approaching the finish line. Well, what do you say to Mikey about flying? Let your student fly by now. I'll see how he handles it. I see that you have chosen a fighter. <laughs> now my student starts to start the fighter and takes off. I am sure that he will be able to do everything the way we studied before. I will be very surprised if Mikey does not have a single chance to break through in this confrontation. I think that's exactly how it's going to happen. I just see a kid from my school flying over the track right now and he's a very cool pilot. He has all the abilities to fly the best planes. He's slowing down on purpose now and showing Mikey's student that he's much better. It's fun! Huh? Therefore, now he will go to our former track and show his piloting skills there too. I am pleased to watch my student go through these tests and show his best side. 
I am only proud that such wonderful children study at my school. Now he's going to start shooting missiles at targets. I think it's very cool and fun. I never would have thought that from the outside it looks so impressive. We need to finish flying. Let's go back. Now my student is starting to perform incredible stunts on this fighter and flies around these rings very beautifully. It remains to be patient very little and he will fly to the finish line. I think that now Mikey will have no questions about who is really the best among our schools. I am incredibly surprised that I managed to make my children one of the best fighter pilots. Uh oh Finish shooting the balls now. I see that you are very good at flying a fighter and I give you an excellent grade. We need to get back to Mikey and see how upset he gets. I'm in such a great mood right now. I feel happy. I am incredibly proud of my student. He's a great guy. Woohoo! I have no words. I am very upset. That's how our incredible story ended. Thank you all so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel, like it, and leave your comments.